and so I'm just I'm making this video I don't know if I'm ever gonna show it to anybody but at least it'll be you know on my computer and on my phone if something does happen I'm sure people will look at all my stuff and I just want everybody to know that I tried and I'm sorry for anything I've ever done wrong in my life I'm trying to do what I can to um, make up for any shortcomings I've ever had and I'm trying to help people I might not always do it the right way but it's the only way I know how at the moment and I love you mom and I love all my brothers and sisters and I love you dad and Karina which is my stepmom because I didn't want to go the easy route God, you know, I would have made a lot of money working, sitting back working, keeping my mouth shut. Just know I did this because there's people out there that just can't. There's old folks and there's kids. There's a lot of people around this area that are sick. And there's a lot of people that's going to get sick. And I'm trying to do something about it. I'm trying to get Enbridge to pay their medical bills. I'm trying to get Enbridge to stand up to the plate and do what's right. Well, I mean, if this happens anytime soon. And I've never had kids. I've always wanted kids all my life. I've wanted to meet the girl in my dreams and get married. And I wanted to be the best father and husband I could ever be. Guess that didn't happen, did it? All right, Bone Ball name is a good name. We're good people. And uh, I just hope people will remember that I tried to do what's right. I love you with all my heart. Don't you ever forget that. And I will miss every single one of you. I want us to be stable. I want us to be happy. That's what I want. Like, why do I gotta feel like this all the time? I don't understand. Honey, you just had kids. You're married to a darn whistleblower, and then we're broke. I, it's it's stressful, and it's gonna get better. I promise you that. But you have to. You have to think about your family. You have to think about me. I. I'm trying. That's you have to think about your kids. I am thinking about my kids more than you can imagine by doing what I do. What about me? You're going to have to accept a little bit that God chose me to do this because you know I... You did same... enough, John. No, honey. You I... can't do anymore by yourself. It's not possible. You can't. What more is there to even do? I don't even understand what more is there to do. Like, you can't physically do any more on your own. Like, whatever people want, like, you can't do it because you're not getting help. Like, it... Yeah, I'm burned out, too, but I, I just... But it's, so just say it's enough. Like, come on. Honey, I, I can't... Just... just People just are dying this. out there. People are dying. John, but you can't. Well, I mean, if we think about this every day, we're going to be so depressed. Like, there's only so much you can do. You've did your share. Listen, God has blessed me with an amazing wife and beautiful little girls. I promise God that as long as he protected you and the kids, you just got to have faith it's all going to work. I just need some financial money coming in so I can pay the bills and not work for free that's that's the biggest issue here I want this to be my job John it can't be your job unless you're getting money I'm I'm on the edge of like tens of millions of people seeing this and learning from it and and stopping pipelines and saving lives and keeping our water clean I'm like so close honey and I'll get you a house I promise I, it's not just about a house, John. And once I get a team around me where I can have an, uh, hire an assistant and hire an editor 
Then well, I don't want any more promises, John. Like, I don't listen to you on the phone all day, every day, into our evening, everything. It's like, it's all the time. You did it. I, for years and years. I know, but I'm... And it's enough. I'm not done, honey. It's enough. Because you stay up all night. Like, it's enough. Enough is enough. Because it consumes you all day. Well, I love you, and that's all I can say. Well, I'm glad, but... Actions are louder than words. You know I've been trying so hard. You know. <laughs> Tell me I haven't tried to... I'm not saying you haven't tried. I mean, working... 20 hours a day most of the time. I'm just, at, my question is, is it really worth it? Like, really? To me, it's worth it. I want Why? my kids to be able to go swimming someday and clean water, and I have to drink bottled water every day. And you're telling me that you're, you yourself are going to make that happen? No, but somebody's got to take the lead, and I am that person. <laughs> it's okay, sweetie pie. Yes, it's going to be okay. It, it is. Look at our beautiful girls. It's going it to be is, okay. I know. We're trying to be strong. It's going to be okay. Forever. You're going to keep being strong, and we're going to make it through this. I've been through ten times worse than this. Honey, I want to be an inspiration to people. I want to be able to... There's an oil spill. Why are you willing to sacrifice for that? I, I want to... Okay. And you didn't think about that question because that's a serious question. What are you willing to sacrifice for this? My life. I'm willing and to your, die. your family? I don't want anything ever to happen to my family, and I don't want to lose my family. I'm just saying I'm willing to sacrifice So you're not willing life. to sacrifice your family for this? I, I'm not going to lose my family. We are, but you might. No. We're going to stay together, and we're going to be happy. I just... It, just give me a little more time. I, I, I will find some people to help us. Let's pray, okay? Can I pray? You can pray. Lord, me and Courtney and our kids honor you and we love you and we cherish every day that you give us together and keep us happy and safe. Please help Courtney with her stress and depression. Please make her life better. Please help me get funding and accomplish goals that I need to do for my family and have the right people see my video and have the right people contact me. Please, I'm begging you, Lord. Please make my wife not cry anymore. Please make her spirit happier. Please protect my family and my kids. I'm giving my life to you, Lord. Just please protect them and keep them safe and happy. Amen. All right. I love you. Okay. All right, sweet dreams. You can just mark up somebody to shoot him in the day. You know, when he went to Washington, just lately I'm thinking to myself, somebody in the crowd just blowing him away. You know, just some stupid somebody that was against this, you know, and him up there speaking and that. I think, man, somebody could have just shot him just up there speaking. Every time then he goes different places to speech, it worries me all the time that some stupid crazy might, person might do something to him. Because they don't they want him talking, they don't want him have, doing something with this stuff. So I'm always afraid they're going to hurt him. Give him plasma so I can have enough uh, money so I can go up and down the river. That's what I do. Basicallyhelper.org is fighting for our water. It's investigating the truth. It's exposing the truth with video proof. I don't care about the death threats. I don't care about me getting sick down the road. I already know I'm going to lose 15, 20 years of my life if I'm not assassinated before then because of the chemicals I've been in from proving this. But I didn't do this for me. This isn't about me. This isn't about John Bolenbaugh. This is about you and you and you, all of you that are here today. This is about all of you. And... That's what I'm fighting for. That's why I'm risking my life for this.